By this time, everyone knows about the biggest tech giant in the world, Elon Musk. He is well known for owning multiple tech companies such as Tesla, SpaceX, The Boring Company, Neuralink, and OpenAI. But recently, he shocked the world by buying the most influential social media platform, Twitter, for roughly $44 billion. The company took over the amount on April 25th from Musk and officially announced his ownership. But do you wonder what made Elon Musk buy Twitter for $44 billion? In today's video, we're going to be looking at how Elon Musk bought Twitter for $44 billion. So, let's go. Elon Musk is considered to be the wealthiest man in the world, with a net worth of $264 billion. He owns countless tech companies, and now we can see Twitter at the top of the list. On Monday, April 25th, Twitter announced that it had accepted the Tesla CEO's offer of $44 billion after evaluating it for over a week. And now the company officially belongs to Elon Musk. Musk bought the company in a leverage buyout, and by doing a leverage buyout, he can later use the assets of the company for the repayment of loans. It has been reported that initially, the CEO, Parag Agrawal, and the board were not in favor of Elon Musk's takeover. But due to the pressure of shareholders, they were forced to make a decision in Musk's favor. The board members even talked with him to sweeten the deal, but he remained stick to his $44 billion offer. Moreover, he was offered to join the board, but he rejected it without stating the reason. Musk purchased a 9.2% stake in Twitter, which made him the second biggest shareholder in the company. This clearly shows his financial interest in Twitter. He always wanted to get a 100% stake in order to make Twitter completely private, which many believe will happen till the end of this year. We hope you're finding this video quite interesting, by the way. To see more interesting luxury content like this, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. What made him buy Twitter? Elon Musk has a great love for Twitter, which made him so keen to take control over it. He always wanted to launch an app which could function on the basis of free speech. And for him, Twitter doesn't fit that portfolio. He wants to transform Twitter into an app which will adhere to the principles of free speech and can be a more open source platform. So now, we can all rely on him to make measures to improve the content moderation policy on the platform. Musk believes that Twitter has an extraordinary potential which needs to be fulfilled. He made a statement that he is not interested in making money out of the company. He just wants to unlock its hidden potential. And he has plans to change Twitter's approach and the way it operates. Many people believe that Twitter will soon become a liberal platform under the influence of Elon Musk, and people will become more comfortable while sharing their opinions. Musk has suggested many ideas to improve Twitter, and one of them is getting rid of spam bots. Spam bots are automated accounts which are mostly used for either advantageous or malicious reasons. Musk is now all set to get rid of all spam accounts on Twitter, so watch out if you have one. And with that, today's video comes to a close. What do you think about Elon Musk buying Twitter? And do you think Musk will be able to make Twitter better than ever with new features? Share your thoughts with us in the comment section down below. Don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and hit that notification bell for future updates. Thanks for watching. See you next time.